Master Crest. What about him? Uh, Master Crest is gone, Lin. He's dead. What? Oh. <laughs> Come on, Argo. Don't joke around. So you really don't remember? You must have amnesia. Master Crest gave his life to protect the Moon Crystal. He was a brave and wise mage. What? But... What are you saying, Argo? Where is Master Crest? Tell me, where is he? Great voice, Ash. Uh, uh. <laughs> where is he? Listen closely, Lin. I know you may not remember, but... I know I don't remember. I just simply don't believe you. You and Master Crest set out, like always, to inspect the Moon Crystal. But that day was different. A flying warship appeared in the night sky and opened fire on the lighthouse. Sounds like... that sounds like that escalated quite quickly. Master Crest sacrificed himself to keep the lighthouse's moon crystal safe from harm. You must have seen that happen, Lin. You yourself came to me in tears and told me all about it. Have you really forgotten? No. I don't believe my master's dead. Lin, I know you don't want to believe it, but you'll never move forward if you keep running from the truth. Lin, we can go save Crest right now. We'll change his history so he won't have to die. You can save him? Why don't you come with us? If your memory returns, you can help save him. My memories... Master... Master Crest... <laughs> I don't know. I just don't know. I can't remember anything. Lin, in the very depths of your heart, I think you want to forget you ever saw Master Crest's death. That's why you can't remember it. But your memories are crucial if we are to save Master Crest. You must do your best to remember. <sighs> Don't worry, there's plenty of time. Let's take Lynn with us and go to the Cape Lighthouse. Maybe that will help her to remember something. Yes, we have to try. Then please, look after Lynn. Good luck, and be careful. Lynn has joined you. Oh, I guess she's a party member. Does she have any power? I'm trying to get your status. Get bonus points when you upgrade up a sword. Okay. That's actually pretty good. At least for Monica. Huh. I like those types of passive abilities. I should have had someone like that for, with me for a, long, for a while now. Oh dear. I guess we'd have to continue with Lin. Uh, da, 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 da. We'll do one more dungeon, and I guess I'll call it one more dungeon. Oh yeah, I could just move there, but I'm just doing it old school. <laughs> oh, I guess we're supposed to go here. Is this gonna be another cutscene? I want to do a damn dungeon. I'm still equipped if I go with the stick. I'm equipped with a heroic stick. Where's my weapon? Oh, there it is. What's the status of this thing? If it, uh, if it has a status. Let me check. Oh, there. What the? Is it fragile? I think that's fragile. Hm. I can't remember. I think you can evolve it like a weapon or whatever. But that would have to mean fighting with a fragile golf club. I'm worried about Lynn. I can't continue. Oh wait, yeah, Lynn's with us. 
or what now? Hey Marco, why don't we rest in your order? Yeah, of course. I actually thought that. I remember there was a cutscene about the order tree. Why didn't it happen as on my way there? Why didn't it happen just right away? Oh well. Uh, oh, there we go. Great, she's starting to have an epileptic seizure. No! Lynn! Master? Why do you want to be a sage? Hmm, that's a good question. Maybe because everyone respects them. Treats them like royalty. <laughs> so he wants to be treated like royalty. That's hey, a good that's reason. that's not right. Don't you mean something like, so I can save the world? <laughs> that works too. To tell the truth, I want to be the kind of person who can put everyone else at ease. Everyone can count on a sage. With a dependable person nearby, danger is always far away. That's what a sage is. Don't you think you'd want someone like that near you? Someone to count on? Yeah, I do. My hometown was an easy target for the thieves that came from the desert. Everyone was constantly on edge, never knowing when they would strike next. <laughs> smiling, those smiling dwarf motherfuckers. <laughs> smiling for everything they're called. As a child, I often wondered, isn't there someone strong out there who can take care of these thugs? What about the sages I read about in fairy tales? Where are they? Well, I was about to find out. It was when the thieves were plundering the village one day. A single robed man showed up out of nowhere. He used mysterious magic to defeat the raiders one by one and defend the village. I thought this must be who I've been waiting for. So I asked him, Why is the text... Are you a sage, I said? Why is the text so behind? He replied, me? I'm no sage. I could never come close. A sage is a person who can defend others just by being there, he said. Just by being there? Is that even possible? That's what I want to do. If I can. So that sage was my role model. <clears throat> Sages are great people, aren't they? So, if you can use a lot of magic, then you can be a sage? Hmm, I wonder. Even I don't know that. <laughs> Dark Demon! What the fuck? Boss? What's that? It's like Nino Cooney or some shit. It's a memo leader, so that's it, huh? I wasn't expecting a boss. Memo leader? That's right. It gets into people's heads and eats up their memories. Okay, um, fight it? <laughs> what a fat tub of crap. Overfoot! First, let me snap All some right, pictures. Let's go. Is there a scoop memo about this thing? I'll just try and snap a quick one. Uh, oh, there. Oh, it's... Ow. Oh, shit. Let me switch to Mon. At least she's not hit by this stuff. Oh. Oh shit! I ain't getting hit by that shit. That was easy. Until Max got slowed and gooed. Demon vanquished! I 
remembered everything. All of it. Well, at least it wasn't something cliche like amnesia. Kinda. It was under this tree that my master told me his dreams of being a sage. Uh, must go to the lighthouse. Save Master Crest. Right, the lighthouse. That's where you and Crest were attacked. So if we go there, we can save Crest. Right, let's go. Uh. Uh, okay. All right. I should be leveling up her brassard <laughs> since I got Lin with me here. Speaking of which, what level is her brassard? It's level five. It's got eight points for something. I think if I keep upgrading fire, it'd become like a flame type for the Prasad, but it looks like I've been upgrading other things. Chill and exorcism. Gotta chill! Chill, dog! Oh, there it is. Let's get them both to 30. Yeah, we defeated it. We got some epic music while we do this. Give them both the 30. Shall be slaying skeletons and uh, quelling fire demons easier. <laughs> oh yeah, I got some Versard stuff. So it's not taking up inventory space, but I got plenty of space to spare. Let's save after all that. And we'll do one more dungeon. I wanted to do a dungeon. Rama priests like cheese. Should I use that so I can make them become a monster form? I don't have any gift capsules. I remember this game too vividly. <laughs> it's a good game. It sticks with you. Oh yeah, where it changes up a little bit. It's kind of nice to be at ground level at least. Much will go up by yeah, a decent chunk. Ah. Thought he'd live by a sliver. Oh well. Ah! He's savage! Ah, oh, great. I need to kill that priest first. He heals other people too. And uh, let's eat some bread, yeah, some stale fucking bread, I love it. Oh man, did I crit or something? Oh, oh wait, crit can only, criticals can only happen from an item, <laughs> item thing. I think I would even put that on. One of them tokens. Do that again. He tried to heal a corpse. Yeah, that little that back handspring takes a bit of time before I can do an action. Okay, let's see if there's something good in here. Okay, let's switch to the raw power. Switch back to Monica and let her collect the ABS. Splits, but whatever. Oh, I didn't even do that. I 
gotta be careful because when I switch over, you, you hold while you're holding block and press L1. I think that's supposed to be the magic shot thing. She charges magic. Oh man, there's quite a bit of mobs. I'm gonna no monster. Being a monster right now is complete suicide. <laughs> I haven't leveled it at all. I don't really see a point of leveling it, other than just you can level it. That's cool. But I never had a point where I need to switch to a monster because it's strong. Knock him over! Oh, no, he's not gonna die like that. Oh. He's gonna stomp on me. He's trying to, though. That's all he's trying to do. Chest stomp strike! Chest stomp strike! Oh, nice. Pop ups. Let's see if we can get his attention. Hey, asshole! It kinda stings, doesn't it? Go ahead and try and heal. Let's get a good charge. Ooh. He ain't guarding that shit. Although, he did. Oh! They both do a nice little spin when they grab the Geostone. <laughs> Surprise, asshole! What the fuck is wrong with him? He was just standing there the whole time letting himself get peppered. AI yeah, can't process doing a healing or attack thing. Heal or attack? Hmm. Heal? Whoa! Fucking bad out of hell! I don't know about you, but. These type food things are scary to me. They're just, I don't know, creepy. Ooh, fire element. Oh yeah, I got the map now. Let's expand that. Oh, good. I head to a dead end. Fuck. Damn you, Starlight Canyon. I hate it when it does this to me. Methodically, I should just try and estimate, like, I don't know, just, either way, I'm, I'm just gonna get unlucky and end up going to a dead end. I haven't even thought about that, it's rather challenging because the map is really random. Monica, Try to jack up all that NP stuff. Well, NP. AP, ABS. Mmm, delicious spring water. Um, just turtling up. Maybe I should take a picture of that. Whatever. Punk. <laughs> They're so brainless, those those particular enemies. They just sit, sit there and let me friggin' jam my magic spells up their ass. And I say, yeah, yeah, you like this, take it. <laughs> oh, magic guy. Always has a little crossfade when it happens. Now. Which shall it be? All right. I don't. I don't know if I wanted the salmon, but I think the repair powder is pretty good. I might have an abundance of it. How much do I have? 
10, yeah, I've been using them up. I thought I had like at least 8 at the time. Hey, bros! He's like frozen! <laughs> what do I do? Commencing tactics. Oh, this guy's actually trying to hover to me. Healing. Spell. Healing. Spell. <laughs> I don't mind fighting those guys. They're easy experience. <laughs> um, um, he's dancing around. He's trying to do a, a chest shanty. That was kind of funny. He just moved to the side and he's like, What do I do now? <laughs> Double chest. Alright, some poison. I'm gonna drink that shit. Normally something you would not, would not do under normal circumstances. Open that shit. Alright, anti-curse. Although, is curse the same as what it was in the original, where you can't switch weapons? Do people normally do that in this game? Do they have not one specified weapon like I do? Do they have multiple ones that serve different purposes? Although there are a few, I think I hear... I, I think there's a few top... A few uh, really good weapons. But universally, I think there is one best weapon in the game, but... I don't know. I think it's Excalibur or something. Oh, double beastie. Double knockout. Bing bing, and I'm knocked out. KO. Clearly, it is all my hard work. <laughs> I never move to it because every time you kill the enemy, all their ABS falls to the ground. And you'd be ditching it behind. What like sensible person would do that? Unless you're revisiting the old dungeon where you're like, the ABS is nothing. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> Where's that, s that delicious meat? Yeah. Yeah, I guess that's it for today.